A lot of people say that I have a few screws loose. Perhaps I do. I'm fragile, but not like a flower, more like a bomb. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm just unpredictable, unforgiving, beautiful, yet dangerous, like Mother Nature. You're right. I have lost my mind, and I don't wish to find it. I lost my mind when I started choosing courage over comfort. I lost my mind when I started choosing me over others who were negatively impacting my life. I lost my mind when I started living for myself. The irony. I have no desire to be normal. Normal? If you were to Google what normal means, it means to conform. If I, if somebody told me right now, you either fit in with everyone else or you're dead. Sweetie, I will volunteer to go jump off the Golden Gate Bridge myself because I have no desire to water myself down to fit in with people who don't even know who they are. The things that I read about myself, <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it tickles me. One, because it's just blasphemous and it's laughable. And probably a little bit because I'm a masochist. Ugh, yes, call me a fucking slut. Ugh. I love it. I know I am. <laughs> but the other part is, is that the best you guys got? That's as low as you're gonna go? Cause I can go lower. Nobody has judged me harsher than I've judged myself. So the things that I read online, that's light work. I've been called worse by better. That better being me. <laughs> My whole life I've judged every little thing about myself. I've lived in shame up until recently, really, when I lost my mind and decided to choose me. I don't need to be saved. <laughs> I'm free. You save yourself. Cause I know exactly who I am and where I'm going is far more significant than what I left behind. I'm not going to change my genetic makeup. It is encoded in me to be exactly who I am. And I am so not sorry. I'm just not. The world needed me and that's why I'm here. I shake tables. I push envelopes. I'm a pusher. <laughs> if it can be destroyed by the truth, it should be destroyed by the truth. I accept what comes behind me being me, even if that's being falsely accused, being ridiculed, dragged. I love it. I love it here. I'm built for this shit, honestly. I do the inner work outside of social media. So you're not gonna see me on here, boo-hoo. I do that in private. <laughs> I do allow myself to feel in private, darling. What are we saying? I have feelings too, you know. I allow myself to feel and I don't judge anything that comes up. And that is why I have endurance. That's why I can handle the load that has just been put on my shoulders. Because I'm really built for this shit. 
there's truly not enough cloth for all of us to be cut from it. In the words of famous pump it up rapper Joe Budden. <laughs> and a wise man once told me that all doors lead to the same destination. So instead of fighting with myself, trying to be something I'm not, I'm gonna just stick to being me and accept it how it comes. Because the one thing I've learned is when life is uncertain, when you don't know what the fuck you're doing, that's when the magic begins. <laughs> in uncertainty, in the unknown, the question mark. What is, uh, uh, surrender. <sighs> I'm surrendering and whatever is gonna happen is gonna happen. Whether I try to fight it or I just go with the flow. I'm free and I love that I'm differently wired because me not being like you is my superpower yeah we're just different and that's okay